Hello everybody, welcome to CSC Innovative Academy. My name is Girishan Patak. In this video, I am going to tell you some tips for learning spoken English. If you want to be fluent in English, first and foremost, you have to make up your mind that I have to be fluent in English. You must be enthusiastic to learn English. You must have zeal to learn English. For learning any language, four skills are required. These skills are listening, speaking, reading and writing. First, I would talk about listening. Let's understand it with an example. When a child gets birth, how he speaks? Does anyone tell him to speak? No. He listens the language his parents and other family members speak understands the language and tries to speak. Starts speaking like ma, 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 pa, pa, pa. Then he starts making simple sentences. If you are a beginner, if you don't understand English, you need to improve your listening skills. If you understand English, it means your listening skills are good. You should make practice of speaking. But if you don't understand English, first you need to work on your listening skills. Now, how can you improve your listening skills? These days we have so many technologies available. Everyone has a smartphone. You can download English audios, videos from internet. You can record any paragraph from English newspaper, then listen it. But don't listen once. Listen at least five or ten times in a day. So that it becomes a part of your memory. You understand it. When you speak, you reproduce that memory. If you follow this practice for 15 to 20 days, I am sure you will be able to understand English. Then we come to next point, speaking. Speak English whenever you get chance. No need to have correct English first. First speak. Don't be afraid of making mistakes. Even a native English speaker makes mistakes. Start with small and simple sentences. Read newspaper and stories in a loud voice. When you read English in a loud voice, it improves your pronunciation. And for increasing your vocabulary, do not learn only meaning of the word. Suppose I find any word and I don't know the meaning of that particular word. Let's say a word abduct. I don't know the meaning of that particular word. I search it in a dictionary. I search for the meaning of that particular word. I find it no problem. I remember that word in the, at that time. But after some times, I forget it. Because I did not use that particular word in a sentence. So whenever you find any difficult word, you search it in dictionary for meaning. Always make a habit to make sentences using that particular word. Because English is not our mother tongue. And about reading and writing, I would not talk much about it. Because our education system teaches us beautifully how to read and write. Students get 80 to 90 percent marks in English, but they can't speak. Because they have problem of listening and speaking. These were some tips for improving your listening, speaking, reading and writing skills. Hope you like this video. Don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel. See you in the next video. Till then, bye-bye.